Hey there, TRW Crew, Matt Vassallo here with rhinestoneworld.com. So this video tutorial is just going to show you how to create some basic shapes. So we had one of our crew members trying to create a triangle and was having some issues just trying to create a basic triangle. So I wanted to show you where to find those basic features here in CorelDRAW. And for watching this video, I'm going to go ahead and tell you at the end of the video how you can get this free pig download. So our TRW Piggy 2 design. We're going to give it away free. This is the design we did yesterday on, sh on showing you how to fill an existing rhinestone design. We did a tutorial video on it yesterday. So of course we're going to go ahead and give this design away to you free of charge as a download file just for being part of the TRW crew and uh, liking us on our Facebook page and YouTube channels. So let's go ahead and show you the shapes here. So I'm going to go ahead and create a new document here real quick. And then what we're going to do is we're just going to create a basic shape. So the shape we want to create here, like I was saying, over here to the left, you have your basic shape tool. So when you click on that, you're going to see up here at the top, you have your perfect shapes. So you're going to see all the different shapes you have here. And you're going to look and probably say, okay, this is probably my triangle right here. But this is just going to actually draw your right angle. So that isn't going to work as far as when we're drawing a triangle. So that's where they're a little bit hidden, but still easy to find. So if you hold it down over here, you'll see your basic shapes, your arrow shapes, your flow chart, your banner, and your callouts. If we just went to our flow chart shapes and click there, you'll see right here we have an upside down and a right side up triangle. So we can just draw it. And if you hold control, it's going to draw a perfect triangle all the way. If you don't, then you can angle it and do whatever kind of different directions you want. So I hold control, I click there. Let's just say I wanted a two row triangle here. I could do a um, two island fill. Let's say we go to the outside. We're going to add stones. We're going to make this, I don't know, a Montana blue. And we're going to do a corner detect on it. We want to detect, detect all of these corners. So we got a 100 degree corner detect on it. And then we're going to go ahead and do our island fill. And you can see it's going to do the island fill right around there and make it look perfect. So everything looks perfect for that triangle. Highlight it. Let's clear our pass and highlight again. Let's merge our overlaps because it's hitting those corners to merge those overlaps. And you are good to go on this triangle design. So that's how you can create just a basic triangle. Another thing you can create here in these shapes. Let's go here real quick and some cool they have some cool different shapes in here and some banner looks things like that um, for example this one right here could mean something to some of you out there because watch what i could do here let's just say i drew that shape real quick and let's squeeze it down a little bit and most of you can probably see what i'm what i'm getting at here and let's say we want this to only be i don't know five inches let's go ahead and add stones to the selected path and we got a hockey puck there so pretty easy to do with basic shapes like that. So you definitely want to use this basic shape tool. You got your banners here. So when you click up here, let's just say we like this banner right here. So we want that to run across. And let's just say we want it nine inches and you got a text or something up there above it. You want it to be two rows of stones to the outside again. And we're going to have our corner detect on. We're going to do an island fill. And you see it's going to hit this banner perfectly in the TRW Stone Wizard. So again, you're just going to clear your pass, merge your overlaps, and you're good to go. So pretty cool as far as all of these different basic shapes that you can do. And very, very good feature in Corel Draw. Some, just some basic features in Corel. So obviously here you have your different rectangle tools and your three-point rectangle, your three-point ellipse tool and your complex stars your regular stars your spirals so if you just wanted to create a spiral real quick you could easily do that and go ahead and add stones to the path and it's just going to add them right along that spiral so a lot of basic tools in corel draw that all of you definitely need to take advantage of because it's going to speed up your design process give you a lot more flexibility in what you do so again with the three point or the ellipse tool right here very some very cool features even when you go to our edit tab and you can pull it around like this and you can see it'll go this way it'll draw half par partial circles this way 
So a lot of different things you can do without having to use your actual pin tools and your beast blinds, your poly lines, things like that, to where you can get away with um, doing a lot of stuff with the basic shapes that are already in Corel Draw. So, and as you can see up here, when I click on our ellipse tool up here, you're gonna see there's the pie tool and the art tool. So when I draw this out here, it's, you got your little Pac-Man look there. So a lot of different things, like I was saying, that you can do with these basic shapes. So these are definitely things you definitely want to kind of play around with, get familiar with, because they're things that are gonna make your design process a whole lot easier in Corel Draw with the TRW Stone Wizard. So hope this video tutorial helped you out. Again, we are going to give away this free pig design right here, and I'm gonna make this one real easy for you. All you need to do is right below this video, just go ahead and click that like button, and go ahead and comment. Let us know if this video helped you out at all. If it did, um, let us know what we what you need help with, if there's any, any other questions that you have in the TRW Stone Wizard, as far as different things you would like or things you would like to learn. We'll definitely create some videos for you. But just look in the description of this video right below, and I'm gonna make it real easy. I'm gonna put the download link right there so you can download this pig design in your EPS and SVG format right away very easy. So definitely check this out. Grab your free pig design. We appreciate you watching all of our videos. We appreciate you being part of the TRW crew, and we look forward to seeing you at one of our shows upcoming soon. We do have a ISS Fort Worth, Texas show that we do have coming up and we will be booth 420 at that show. And that is uh, September 26th through the 28th. So make sure to come check us out in Fort Worth. And we will have many more shows lined up before that, after that. So make sure to check out our schedule on our website. So again, this is Matt with the rhinestoneworld.com. Make sure to go grab that free pig design, like the video, comment below, and uh, you guys have a wonderful day.